these acts and take away your rights shit, I don't really listen to none of that stuff. I'm not fine for no acts and statues and rights like that. I'm not here to do that. I'm here to go against them as usual. And um, I just bring the information to the people. And not ask government, stop asking governments for permission like these people, like some of these people like to ask for permission from government. Governments don't exist. That's it, they don't exist. And we have to treat them like they don't exist, you know what I mean? That's how I feel about that. You know, it's a good turnout today as well, so a lot of people here today. They've been doing it from the beginning, like the first time, the first time the mainstream media know who I was, was, was back in June 2020. And they was late anyway, because we went to Morrison's, that's when people start to find each other. When we went inside Morrison's. It was only about it was about 30, 40 of us, but about seven of us went inside Morrison's, and that catapulted everything. We did a lot, we did a protest inside Morrison's. The mainstream media got a hold of it in August, and yeah, you know. So yeah, they've been trying to talk shit, but I don't care about if who knows me. It's not about the people. Who knows me? It's about people who knows what's going on with the truth. You understand I me? Mean? It's not about an individual. I don't, I'm not here for people to get to know me. But to get to know the truth. I'm just a vessel, or a shell if you want to call it that, that just have the courage to go out there and make sure the people put the information in the hands of the people. Opposed to just posting it on social media. You have to go out there and give the people the information. The is great bro, even if somebody tell me fuck you or uh, it doesn't matter, it doesn't register in my head, <laughs> you know, because like I always say you can't, when you're, when, you're, when you're fighting against the system, you're fighting against everything within the system, therefore you're gonna have the worst happen to you. If you was on their side then you, you, you know you would be comfortable, you would be sitting comfortable. But we, we are against them, so they own the media, they own the social media, they own a lot of these sh sh slaves. I call some of these people slaves because they talk on social media about they're brave and I'm a strong man, I'm a strong woman. Like I always say, they're strong in the gym, they're not strong in real life. And when you're strong in real life, and, and I think some of these people have to see the children drop dead in front of them before they have to fucking really get serious and do something. So talk is cheap, just go and do the work.